today's video, I'm going to show you how to optimize your CPU for gaming like a pro. Get ready for higher FPS and zero input delay. I'll walk you through some must-know settings that will instantly boost your in-game performance. If you're new here, don't forget to smash that like button and hit subscribe so you never miss out on these game-changing tips. Let's jump right in. Let's optimize your Windows power plan to maximize your CPU's performance. Begin by clicking the Windows search icon and typing power options in the search bar. From the results, choose edit power plan or choose a power plan to access the power settings. In the window that appears, select the High Performance Plan. If it's not listed, expand the options by clicking Show Additional Plans. Once selected, click Change Plan Settings next to the High Performance option, and then click Change Advanced Power Settings to access detailed configurations. In the Advanced Power Settings pop-up, find the Hard Disk category and expand it. Adjust the Turn Off Hard Disk After setting to Never or set the time to 0 minutes to prevent the hard drive from entering power saving mode. Next, navigate to the Processor Power Management section, one of the most critical areas for improving CPU performance. Expand it and set both the minimum processor state and maximum processor state to 100. This ensures your CPU consistently runs at its maximum capacity without throttling. Once you've adjusted these settings, click Apply and then OK to save the changes. Close the window and your system will now prioritize performance, giving your CPU the boost it needs for better gaming and overall responsiveness. Next, let's fine-tune your system for maximum performance. Start by opening the Windows search bar and typing Advanced System Settings. Click on the result to bring up the System Properties window. Under the Advanced tab, locate the Performance section and click on the Settings button. In the Performance Options window, switch to the Advanced tab. Here, you'll see a section for Processor Scheduling. This setting determines how your CPU resources are allocated. Select Programs to ensure that active applications, like games or streaming software, get the majority of your system's processing power. Avoid choosing Background Services, as it allocates resources to background tasks, which is not ideal for gaming or other high-performance needs. By prioritizing active programs, your system will focus its resources on whatever task is currently in use. For example, you're playing a game, this adjustment ensures that the game gets top priority, boosting its performance. Once done, click Apply and OK to save your changes. Now guys, you need to download this CPU optimization pack on your PC. You can download this pack from my website, link is in description. After download, extract it on your desktop and open the CPU optimization folder and install all these files one by one. After that, go into CPU priority folder and here you will see two options, AMD and Intel. Choose the folder as your CPU. If you have Intel CPU, then install this Intel file, and if you have AMD CPU, then choose this file and install it. Now guys, install this quick boost application on your PC to instantly boost your CPU performance. When you launch the tool, you'll be greeted with several tabs, General, Advanced, Cleanup, Downloads, and Windows. Let's start with the General tab, where you'll find key tweaks that should be applied, especially after updating Windows. Among these are options to enable exclusive full-screen mode, disable the Xbox Game Bar, and turn off startup telemetry to stop unnecessary data collection. You can also disable mouse acceleration for precise cursor movement during gaming, turn off power savings mode for maximum performance, and disable unnecessary system services to free up valuable resources. This tool lets you remove pre-installed bloatware and unwanted games that come with your PC, clearing up space and improving overall system performance. Another great feature is the Disable Startup Programs option, which lets you manage which apps load when your PC starts. It's a simple way to streamline your startup process and ensure your PC runs more efficiently from the get-go. Next, under the Advanced tab, you'll find even deeper optimizations. One important tweak is to disable Power Forward Link, which removes a hidden power saving mode that can slow down your system. Memory tweaks will ensure your RAM operates at optimal speed, while adjusting the hardware data queue size improves the responsiveness of your mouse and keyboard, especially beneficial for gamers who need quick, precise inputs. In the Storage tab, you'll find a variety of cleanup options to improve system efficiency. You can clean temporary files, clear out log files, run Windows Disk Cleanup, and remove other junk files that may have accumulated. These actions are easy to perform and offer noticeable improvements in your PC's performance. Finally, the Windows tab contains additional customization options. You can choose to show hidden folders to access temporary data, disable notifications to avoid distractions, and turn off clipboard history to prevent unnecessary data from being stored. 
you can also disable transparency effects. While this may reduce visual appeal, it boosts performance, especially on lower-end systems. Once you've applied all these optimizations, restart your PC to finalize the changes. After that, you can safely uninstall Quick Boost as it's no longer necessary to keep it running. To get started with Gear Up Booster, download the tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your Ping C. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the middle server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now, go to the Not tab, where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let GearUp automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to Automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using Gear Up Booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Now head to the search bar and type Show Animations in Windows. Many people overlook this, but both Windows 10 and 11 have an option to customize the animations throughout the system. When this feature is turned on, you'll see smooth, visually appealing animations when switching between windows. However, these animations can consume a fair amount of your computer's resources, slowing things down. To optimize your system, turn this feature off. Once disabled, all animations will be removed, giving your PC a quicker, snappier feel. Next, there's another setting called Show Transparency in Windows. This controls the transparency effect across different areas of your system, like the taskbar and other background windows. While it looks cool, it can also drain system resources, especially on older or less powerful machines. Simply turn this setting off to remove the transparency effect and help your PC run faster. By disabling both of these settings, your system will operate more efficiently, reducing unnecessary visual effects and allowing your hardware to focus on performance instead. In the next step, guys, open your task manager and go to the Services tab, in Services tab, look for Xbox services like Xbox Auth Manager, Xbox GameSave, Xbox JIP, SVC, and Xbox Net. If you're not using Xbox features, right-click on each and select Stop. Disabling these services can save up to 40 processor cores and free up valuable CPU resources. This simple tweak can lead to a noticeable performance boost, so make sure to disable them for a smoother, faster experience. Restart your PC at the end of the video to finalize the changes. So guys, that was today's video. Hit the like button and make sure to subscribe. Feel free to ask any question in comment box. Peace out.